Hello YouTube, how's everyone doing? And welcome back to Let's Play Tomb Raider 3. We are on the last of the India levels. I believe this level is called Caves of Kalia. Uh, yes, Caves of Kalia. So this is the final level in the India sections of Tomb Raider 3. There are, to my knowledge, no secrets on this level, so we don't have to worry about getting secrets. It's not a really, really long level, but it is a bit of a confusing level because it's a cave. And like I said before, there's no secrets, but there's a couple of pickups. So if you want the pickups, you're going to have to do a little bit of playing the level through a couple of times and then you'll know the route, the optimal route to take to get to the end of the level. So when you start a level, you can go left or right. If you decide to go to the right, crawl under this crawl space here. There'll be a long green corridor here. Now this is a trap. And if the music doesn't give it away, because the music isn't calming or relaxing. If you look above Lara's head, you will see something above her head. Let's see if the camera can... Yes, a boulder. In this section, you're gonna have to outrun two boulders if you decide to come this way, so. As soon as I slide down this slope, that boulder is going to start coming down after me. But there is a little passageway just to the left. And if you stay in that passageway, you can get past this first boulder. So once again, if you don't feel too confident, you can always save your game. In case something does happen. So I'm going to slide here, jump and quickly run. Okay, that, that is a miracle how that never touched me. How the hell did that boulder not crush me? How the hell did that, did that not crush me? I was right in front of it. But okay, I got that on video. There's also another boulder here that's gonna come down, but you have to trigger it and run into the alcove here. So once again, how come the sprint button's not working? That's strange. Unless it's... The crouch button's working, but the sprint button isn't working. Hmm. I don't know why that is. It's never done that before, guys. Technical difficulties already. No, it's just not working. I think this controller's on its way out. just not working at all so yeah that's not good so okay we'll try and do it without sprints so you do the same thing here trigger the boulder and then run into here one more should do it that's the boulder. Okay, that's the second boulder. And then we can climb up here. However, do be careful because in these corridors there are some hidden cobras, as you can see here. So be 
very, very careful with that. Although this, although this level is quite short, it does have some hidden enemies like the Cobras. So I don't think he's guarding anything. It's just one Cobra. But you can you can ignore him if you want. You can avoid him. He doesn't have any items for us to take. Go to the right. And then it cuts left and right. Go to the right again. And here you'll find some shotgun shells. That's if you went to the right. Okay, so going to the left this time, leads you to another hallway. Is that a movable block? I think that, yeah, that's a movable block. Let's push this. As far as it'll go. as far as it's going. Another snake. So, another snake. And this cobra was guarding a small mini pack just here. It's a dead end, but you can go to the right, just here. Okay, anything down here? Anything for me to take? I think you're meant to go this way, eventually. I think this is where we came up with the boulders, so yeah, I think this is where the boulders, I'm not too sure, I'm not 100% sure, but we'll leave that for a few minutes, we'll come back here. I can't get back up, okay. Can I get up this way? No, not at all. So once you drop down here, you obviously can't get back up, so... Okay. For this crawl space. And this will lead us back to the start of the level. So this is the correct way to go. There's some flares here. And a save crystal and what appears to be a large square hole in the floor. You're going to have to drop down here eventually to grab the save crystal. Hang and drop. And you'll notice here you're in very 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 grave danger there are cobras all around two in the corner and two in this corner so you're probably thinking oh crap what do we do slowly take out your pistols Step back, 
once shoot your way through that's two three four but it doesn't end it doesn't end there there are more snakes in front of us but to make matters worse there's a boulder primed ready to roll down so what I do here I get close to these ramps I side jump onto the ramp which will trigger the boulder and then jump and Lara should just jump straight over the boulder just do that a few times and now we can safely take care of the snakes. One, two, there's another four here. Wakey wakey, three, four, and there's one last set just here. to the corridor where the boulder passed. There's a crawl space here. Go through the crawl space. Drop down here. You'll get another save crystal here. And this is here for a reason. There's also a small medipack here. So Make sure you pick that up. Make sure you save your game here because as you slide down this last slope you're going to be meeting an old friend and the first boss of Tomb Raider 3. As you slide into here you'll come face to face with Tony, the researcher from the cutscene at the end of the first level and it's our time to give him back what he gave us. So Tony, I don't know if you remember a girl like Lara Croft, but I'm here to kill you. Because you tried to kill me. So now you must die. Oh, I've been set on fire. Tony had the hots for Lara. And that's the end of Tony. As long as you stay on this platform and just jump from left to right while firing at him, he's he's pretty easy. Once he's dead, pick up the items, the small medipack here. We've got another new weapon here, the grenade launcher. So we get the grenade launcher. However, we don't have a lot of ammo for it, unfortunately, but we do have the grenade launcher. And we get some grenades on this final platform. So this is pretty much the end of the India levels and this level in general, the Caves of Kalia. Once you've defeated Tony for the first time, he leaves behind one of the Enfada stones, which is what Lara is now searching for in this game. Because when this game when this game started, we had no idea what Lara was in search for. 
now she has a purpose in this game and the purpose is the Infada Stones. I believe there's four of these to collect all through Tomb Raider 3 and this is the first. So after you pick this first artifact up you will get another cutscene. to the music for I am the level. Okay. 
Okay, Stephen. Amen. Stephen was to be the only survivor of the four. When he arrived back in London, he superstitiously sold off his artifact, having seen his pals murdered or killed with theirs. One here in India, one in the South Pacific, and one in Nevada. The places where I'd like to go. Sounds good to me. Okay, that is the end of that cutscene. Basically, if you didn't understand that cutscene, what Doc, what Willard is asking Lara is more about the the stone she just found, the Infada stones, and there are more than one. There's about four. One in one in India, one in Nevada, one in the South Pacific, and one in London. So, what I didn't understand from that cutscene there is he he wants Lara to find the four artifacts pretty much but Lara doesn't question him you know you would think she would have said well, well what's your intentions of using them for you know but just like like a good little girl she just accepts it and just says yeah I'll find the stones for you you know and this is kind of where I got the question in my mind as if to say, well, why didn't you ask him, you know, why do you want me to find these artifacts? What is your use of them? She doesn't ask him that and he doesn't elaborate on that. So she, he just basically asks, look, find these, find these, you know, the artifacts. And then she's like, yeah, sure, I'll find them. Sounds good to me, you know, but it's one of the, one of the many questions I've always wondered when playing this game is that she doesn't ask him why he wants the artifacts and I'm sure we'll find out as the game progresses the let's play progresses his intentions for using said artifacts so this is the end of the caves of Kalia level it's not a lot it's not a very long level it's quite short but you have to play through the level a couple of times if you want if you want all the items and but I probably did miss a couple of items but all you get really is shotgun shells and medipacks and flares not really not really many items it's, it's a pretty linear level so this is the end of the India section now you guys have to make a choice And the choice you guys have to make is you're going to pick the next destination which ultimately I will be making videos for. So we have three choices, South Pacific Islands, Nevada, or you can be cockney like me and go to London. So it's up to you guys, South Pacific Islands, Nevada, or do you want to go to London? You slag. <laughs> so I have done a community post on this and quite a few people have voted, but I'm going to let the community post run till the end of this month. So you guys have got till the end of June this month if you haven't voted already there is still time to vote so it's now up to you guys where we go from here south pacific islands nevada or london you choose if you haven't voted yet there is still time to vote please take a moment and vote if you would like to and i'll see you guys in the next set of levels whether it's south pacific islands london or nevada Thank you very much for watching, see you guys in the next one. Take it easy, be safe, bye for now.